<laughs> so you're really gonna marry Ethan, huh? Yeah, and I find it amusing that you have such a hard time believing it. Worried that I'm stealing your best friend away? Uh, I guess I just think it would be more rewarding to go work in an assisted living community. At least then you'd be getting paid for taking care of those that can't take care of themselves. Let's not be dramatic here. Ethan can take care of himself. Oh? The first time I sent Ethan grocery shopping by himself, he came back with 16 bags full of bananas. Bananas? Why bananas? Because the produce section was the first thing he saw when he walked in the door. Bananas are healthy. I make dinner every night because Ethan doesn't know how to cook. If it weren't for takeout service and my willingness to cook, he'd probably starve to death. Okay, now that is overdramatic. Given no other options, at the very least, Ethan's survival instincts would kick in, and he'd feed himself. Fair enough. Tomorrow we'll unplug the phone, and I won't make dinner. Food? Please? So hungry. Want dinner. Give! Damn it. Ooh, I can totally get you guys a bedpan for your wedding gift. Hello? Phone people? Please! I need food! So hungry! Hey, Ethan, I was thinking... Don't do that! It takes you out of the gaming groove. No, I was thinking I'd invite a friend of mine from work over for dinner. Friend, food, cool. I was also thinking you and I would cook. Yeah, that's a great idea! Really? Definitely! What do you feel like? Chinese pizza? Ooh, maybe Chinese. No, Ethan, I meant... Cook something from scratch, like you and me in the kitchen making food. Oh, I cooked in the kitchen once. Okay, I've invited Karen over for dinner tonight. She'll be here at 7. That gives us four hours to make dinner. We're just going to make a simple chicken dish, so pay attention. What does this... <coughs> what the hell, man? I'd just rather catch any fires before they start. But uh, it's just a metal squiggly wire thingy. Around you, anything becomes flammable. Well, I don't like to brag. Ethan, could you pay attention here? I think we're going to need all the time we've got. Aye, aye, Captain. Okay, that's just about it. And this is my roommate, Lucas. Very nice to meet you, Karen. <laughs> nice to meet you, too. Um, and that's my fiancé, Ethan. I'd better go check on him. Lucas, would you mind entertaining Karen for a moment? What was that noise? What noise? I didn't hear any noise. It was a TV. Okay. Take the chicken out of the oven. I'm going to go set the table. Congratulations, sweetie. You've just cooked your first meal. Wow. I made this. I'm really a cook. Stay away! Stay away, you felt-covered demon!